Hi Capricorn! Welcome to my channel. We're doing your February couples uh, love reading. This which is going to be a regular for, for this channel. I'm using the Fountain Turk and the... Ah, I still can't remember this. <laughs> it's the Tower of Sexual Magic and Angel Romans Oracle for your guidance. Let's see what you guys have for February love for couples. Capricorn. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> okay. You are having some issues with regards to this person, the one you're with right now. It's because you want, uh, you want, I, from other things, like you want to, you want to up the relationship one more level. Meaning, <laughs> you want bigger commitment from the person. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Yeah, you want them to make a decision on how far you want this relationship. How serious? Because I think you guys are dating, seeing each other, yes. But um, you want them exclusive. That's what you're saying. Two of Swords, uh, King of Wands. So they're just saying that, well, you know, the person <clears throat> is... Uh, possible fire sign okay but uh, they're saying that this person is uh, both juggling you and the career and you also is very busy because you're a queen of coins over here so both of you are king and queen okay this very 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 uh, um, not conflicting but very ambitious relationship okay and that's why you wanted to go to the next level mm -hmm. interesting we have here also queen of pentacles yep it's, it's totally you okay you want the person to, from what they're saying, even like, you want the person to quit at their job and just be with you because you can give whatever they want or the other way around. Eight of Swords here, okay? Because you feel that since both of you are very passionate with work, not, nobody wants to give in. You know, like, how can we move on to this next level when both of us are always busy, when both of us are catching our own dreams? We have Eight of Swords and Seven of Swords. And five of one, so you felt that you're left out or the other person is left out when it comes to experiencing the relationship. So you have your two of swords and a judgment. You want them to decide. You want them to decide now because you have here seven of uh, chalices, which is just saying that you really want this person to just, um, just stop and be with you. But you, they, I don't think they can stop with their life and just be with you or the other way around, you know. I, that's gonna have some codependency in the relationship, okay. But you're coming from a place of <clears throat> needing and wanting more of the person, okay. Let's see. Okay, so it's um, take some time out, retreat, okay. So, yeah, that's what you want, <laughs> okay. So, you want some time out with the person. Okay, because nobody is oh nobody's ever at home. That's what they're saying. Nobody's ever at home. Nobody like you probably eat dinner by yourself and you're getting tired of that. You want something like you know, like um, even though you're not living together, for example, um, you guys can never even put a date on when you guys are gonna go out. Okay, because you have King of Wands, Queen of Coins. Um, master of your finances, master of your destiny, that's what they're saying. And at the same time, that it's the person you're dealing with is that they are also master of their own life, okay? Very, very strong person. Both of you are very strong person. Someone needs to really ground there. That's a message. Ground yourself. Okay, Capricorn, thank you very much for, um, for watching. My name is Sal. I'll see you guys again in March. Um, the link down below for...